Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common issue that many Django developers encounter. Our viewer is trying to set a minimum value for a float field, ensuring that the form does not accept negative values. However, they find that while using positive integer field works seamlessly for integers, the min value validator doesn't seem to function as expected for floats. Let's dive into this intriguing question and explore the nuances of Django validators. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through a question, going through those answers, and hopefully it leads to your solution. Remember, stay a little bit crazy, just like me, to get through to your resolution. Now let's get started. To set a minimum value for a float field in Django, we can use the min value validator. However, there are some important considerations to keep in mind. First, ensure that you have imported the min value validator from django.core.validators. This is essential for applying the validation to your float field. Next, when defining your float field, you can specify the min value validator with a value of zero to prevent negative inputs. If the validator still does not seem to work, check if there are any other validations or constraints in your form that might be conflicting. Finally, remember to test your form to ensure that it correctly rejects negative values and only accepts valid float inputs. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To resolve the issue with validators not working in Django, this user shares their implementation of a coupon model. They use min value validator and max value validator for the discount field. The discount field is set to accept values from 0 to 100, ensuring that the discount rate is a valid percentage. The user encourages trying this approach, suggesting it might work for your needs. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the issue with validators not working in Django, make sure to define the decimal correctly. Use min value validator with a decimal value. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To solve the issue with validators not working in Django, you can create a custom field called positive float field. This field extends float field and allows you to add a minimum value validator. In your model, you can then use this positive float field to ensure that the height value is always a positive float. And that's it guys. I hope that's found the answer that you were looking for and you got through to that solution. If you did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time, you have a technical issue, I'll see ya. Have a good one.